Hello, this is Bob from Universal Player Piano Repair. With the valves done, the tape over, the bleeder, machining holes, it's time to install the repouched pouches. Run a vacuum cleaner hose across all the pouch holes to remove any leftover debris. Uh, I'm going to demonstrate putting some of these pouches in. One additional thing you may want to do is make sure that all the leather is off of the sides of the pouches. And I, I just push these in. They seat real easy. And uh, sometimes you, you have to actually use a, um, a press to get them in, but not these. These go in real easy. I'm only going to do two here to show you how they, they go in. Um, and those are seated real well. Now from Pat Catan, I bought a little squeeze bottle and I put filled it with PVCE. I don't care if they go in hard, easy, or whatever. Uh, they still leak around the edges and it screws up the bleeder holes. So um, I, uh, I seal all the way around. It only takes a very, very short time to seal them. That's a really a great insurance. And the piano works really well after that. Okay. Once that's done, I let that dry. Then what I do is I take a 50% solution of rubber cement. I got this from Amazon and 50% thinner. I mix that in a jar and I saturate the entire leather with that and uh, I let that dry. And then what I do is I, I test it. And the way to test it is you take a foot and a half piece of tracker bar tubing, you put it in, and you take a, a skewer, uh, you can get it at any, um, any food store, but you got to put it in the, uh, the bleeder hole, and then you can blow on it. And you can tell if it leaks or not because you can tell airs, um, you know, going into the pouch. And then if it's still leaking, what you're going to have to do is you're, you're going to have to use additional rubber cement. But when you're all done, when you're happy that there's no leaks, what I do is I use Johnson's baby powder and I, I go around all the insides and I do that to prevent sticking for the little pusher for the valve because I, I, I want to act as an interface and I, I don't want it sticking and you know possibly uh, cocking it so that I, I'm getting leakage. And that's it. Thank you for watching. Hello, this is Bob from Universal Player Piano Repair. I built a player piano service manual for the Universal and explains everything you need to know about rebuilding it, servicing it, and actually uh, using it. Uh, I, I charge $49.95 uh, as postage paid anywhere here in the United States. Thank you very much for watching. Bye now.